Fox 16. It's the most wonderful time of the show. Can you tell them in the holiday spirit? You know, I'm feeling like Santa right now because I'm giving away not just three gifts, giving away five. Let's unwrap them. It's top place. Conway and Springdale and Manny Smith puts the man in Manny. You can't stop him because you won't stop him. He breaks like five tackles to make it to the end zone. What an incredible run. Conway wins big to move on to the second round of the state playoffs. That was a fun game. Hey, number four, Pine Bluff hosts in Mountain Home. Courtney Crutchfield, more like Courtney Clutchfield. Yeah, I said it, over the shoulder grab and throws the defender off of him like Derek Henry. All for the touchdown too. I love this play. One more time, just yeets him off. That's something the kids say, right? Pine Bluff ended up losing this game by four to Mountain Home. All right, top three time. Russellville taking on Sylvan Hills. Gavin Graham playing hot potato with the football. Ends up coming down with it. And the only thing that stops him from scoring is a sniper, probably from Call of Duty. They always get me. But the one-handed circus act, that's good for number three on our top plays. In second, easily the best catch of the season, Luan Winningham. No butter on these fingers. The football in his hand, they were just meant to be together. UCA went on to get revenge against Eastern Kentucky. 37-25 at home. Luan had a good game. All right, number one, Arkansas, Florida. Traylon Smith got to change his name to Trey Gon Smith. This was his first run of the night, and it was a good one. 83 yards, and he go. Longest touchdown run for the Hogs against a SEC opponent in nine years. They still lost, but you know, Traylon had over 100 yards for the first time in his career, so that is a win. Big night for him. Unfortunately, that's going to do it for us tonight. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you have a great week. Chris says a goodbye. Hayden, Kristen, everybody in production says goodbye. See you next week on The Final Score.